Every American citizen must have an equal right to vote. There is no moral issue. We're the United States of America. One man, one vote. If that's our definition of democracy, and then we don't give the one man the vote, big fat lie. What happens in North Carolina is going to be very important for what happens in the whole country. This is the test ground for voter rights. The NAACP claims a state board of elections and three county boards are removing thousands of people from voter rolls illegally. People volunteer in a lot of ways. I work for everyone to be able to vote. Well, I've been clicking back and forth, website to website, trying to figure out where I could be most useful. I feel a little bit like I'm stepping off a cliff. People on the ground are already reporting suppression of the vote. Our legislature decided to pass some voter restrictions that significantly altered voting in North Carolina. We knew it was being challenged in court. So how do we even prepare for election day not knowing what laws are gonna be in effect? I wish I knew this law as well as I know my everyday working law, and it's important because I only get one chance to get it right. I'm hoping that we will merely be observing people carrying out their democratic rights in a peaceful way. I am a lawyer, and I've been assigned to answer questions. This woman was just telling us she got in right at the beginning, and they kept her in there for 45 minutes, said it was a complete mess. Excuse me, ma'am, did everything go okay? Were you able to vote? They sent me from the one on Cliffdale over here, and now I got to go over there. Me and two other black guys are the only guys that the DMV forgot to process. They sent me here. Now these people here tell me I cannot vote here. It's not here. No, no. This is not here fair. Help. Nobody would fight this hard to take something from us that wasn't powerful. When you deny a person the right to vote, then you take away every other constitutional right that they might have. People are aware that there's a problem. I don't believe people are aware of the extent of the problem. The history of our country is a history of struggle for the right to have a voice. Each one of us has some valuable asset that we can use to fight these fights that need to be fought now. We better use what's in our hands. The heart and soul of America is at stake.